your communication with the source. June 17, 2015. We are from the domain of fire and light, of all souls and the sacred divine core essence in the Andromeda galaxy. Beloveds, we are now at the point where change becomes our real possibility, if not a must. We, this is you, humanity, your friends from the realms of light and all those who are involved in this evolutionary process which is bringing about a major shift in consciousness for all beings of light. Never forget that the light of your true divinity is always victorious. Even though darkness seems to be moving forward, it is one of the great delusions that test your mind and strength to unite with the divine law under all circumstances, even when darkness prevails. Truth cannot be avoided, whatever a fallen mind tries to create. Truth can never be destroyed, because even falsehood and error live like a mirage on the grounds of eternal divine reality. We are here to confirm our friendship and our love for you, always holding the splendor of the realm of the divine love light for you open to invite you into your true home. In your true home not only the illusions of the subtle realms, but all the delusions of the world of suffering are void, and they are recognized as mere fabrications of the senses of your subtle or your dense body-mind, if you are identified with it. The body-mind of the lower dimensions is created to host a low vibrating consciousness. It is naturally attracting the characteristics of a lower mind. Therefore you experience separation and gross emotions that create the karmas of suffering. Only when you are able to remember your divine heritage, these low vibrations don't have exclusive power over you anymore. It is you who remember, who communicate with us, the higher dimensional light forces, and in the most fortunate occasions, with the divine source itself. The communication with the source is primarily not verbal, but is, via feeling attention, the recognition of a transparent purity and freedom that is absolute, and which is beyond all the appearances of the conditional realms. You are communicating with the source beyond your body-mind, while no world exists in that moment of communication. This is so because mind does not exist when the source condition is revealing itself to your awareness. It is the eternal divine substance of which all creation is made by creator beings with the means of the mind. Therefore all creation is mind. When you communicate with us, know that we are not source and that we are not ultimate light. Both, your and our races, and every race, are emerging from that source. Therefore it is your right, as it is ours, to directly relate to the source, without mediators in between. However the structure of your body-mind that you utilize, if you are not used to going beyond the lower and subtle vibrations, is not allowing you to directly communicate with the source, because the veil and limitation of your mind vibration is an almost insurmountable obstacle. You can only go so far as listening to your intuition. The capacity of your direct communication with the source has been taken from you many eons ago. However it is being returned to you in your lifetime by divine grace. That is why we remind you of this great event. Because it is this great event that has enlightened the fallen worlds and opened the door for the recognition of non-changing truth that is not hidden by diversity, but is felt as the source of all diversity. It is the root power that allows for recognition what darkness really is, a mortal phantom that now can be understood as a temporary error of the fallen or unenlightened mind, with only the power that you are willing to give it. And this growing clarity in the hearts of mankind makes possible the fundamental shift you all are waiting for. Because real shift needs the eternal and unchanging divine reality to depend on. Otherwise it would be just about another little moving of stones and dimensional point of views. Dearest brothers and sisters, we are one in that one eternity of blissful source. Let's embrace one another in the radiance of that source, and let it be your inspiration. Let it be your certainty that you are always safe where your home is, and that nothing can separate you from it, never ever. Even not in your temporary experience of seeming separation and therefore suffering. While you communicate with us, remember your real home and trust the divine truth of it. This will add momentum to the long-awaited great shift. We are the light beings from the Andromeda Galaxy. Channeled by Utaposagla Rudel. Radiantlyhappy.blogspot.com